hello everyone um, we are here to showcase some of the abilities of the ballista um, it's not r really in a great state right now so um, right here I have a friend helping me showcase the speed the maneuverability um, usage in battle um, and some other sorts of um, use for this tank so we feel like um, there's a change needed for this tank. It's been sitting in the back for a very long time. And I hope this video will help achieve that. Okay, so here we'll be testing the speed of the ballista uh, on road uh, compared to a infantry running next to it. Um, okay, so uh, I think we can go. Let's, um, so this is the speed of the ballista compared to the infantry. Um, as you can see, even on road, ballista is pretty, pretty slow. Uh, if you know, I keep running, I'll lose him off the screen soon. Okay, so in this one, um, we're gonna showcase the speed of it off road. Um, same thing as on road. So, okay, let's uh, start running. So as you can see, again, um, m it might be even worse than on road because I've I've just lost him again, um, and yeah, as you can see, it's really really slow. Um, and I'm not even sprinting. So, alright. So here um, we're gonna showcase the uh, supposed equivalent of the ballista for the wardens again. This is not for the purposes of changing the chieftain itself. This is just to showcase uh, what the other equivalent looks like. Um, again, showcase the speed in this case. Um, so here we go. Okay, so let's start running down the road. So as you can see, the speed's pretty, pretty good. Um, I'm not sprinting can outrun the infantry which in this case makes lo makes sense because it is a tank although it, it's a heavy tank um, still faster than an infantry so uh, here we are again uh, we're gonna test chieftain's off-road speed compared to infantry running next to it um, again uh, this is not to nerve the chieftain this is just to showcase different speeds between two equivalent tanks on two different sides um, and here we go. All right, let's uh, start. Sorry, I should have the start. It's okay. Let's go. So as you can see, off-road, uh, Chiefs is kind of slower a bit, which it also makes sense because this is, you know, dirt road, um, and uh, totally makes sense to be a little bit slower. But still, it's on pars with the infantry speed running again, not sprinting. So. Okay, so right here, uh, I'm showcasing the amount of slots Ballista has, which is, in my opinion, from uh, the battles, uh, more than the Ballista will ever use in in um, in a single attack. There's ten slots plus one shell in the barrel, which is total of eleven, um, and in my opinion, in 90% of the cases the ballista is barely going to be able to shoot five or six shells and the chieftain itself has six slots plus uh, one mag of MG and one 250 mil inside the barrels um, for, for which in my personal opinion is really good because this is the exact amount of shells you're probably gonna be um, using in a single assault in uh, the in these kind kinds of uh, tanks and uh, because after probably five or six shells the tanks gonna die to either AI you know the retaliation or the infantry um, if it if it and uh, shoots even more shells then you know the driver and the gunners are really lucky but in most cases um, this is the exact amount of shells you're gonna be using um, on an enemy uh, again he has a specific slot for 12.7 because uh, chieftain has a 
um, 12.7 turret with a good traversal speed as you can see um, we're going to do a comparison of how fast the infantry can run around, around this tank and uh, compared to its um, turning speed um, again this is not um, to showcase uh, anything other than um, the different uh, different features that each of these two tanks have or do not have okay so uh, as we can see here uh, our Recording. friend is yep yep our friend is going to suppress the pill and right here we're going to showcase the it's already suppressed yep yep and it's two shots uh, yeah keep uh, keep shooting it as you can see he's not even used his whole mag he's still suppressing it and this just showcases the strength of having an MG turret on your tank because right now any friendly tanks can just come in, pop the pill, pillbox, kill it and um, push on and uh, for the Ballista, the Chieftain's counterpart um, as you can see it doesn't have a 12.7 gun or a barrel so suppression is uh, not an option which kinda also minimizes the use case of this tank even in battle you can't use it to suppress some uh, garrisons with it help your infantry out okay so here uh, we are gonna showcase the reverse speed and the defensive capabilities of both the ballista and its counterpart on the warren side and we can start so I'll start reversing and right now we're gonna see a enemy infantry running up to us in the night time and uh, see the defensive capabilities of both tanks and as you can see the first hit is a track but we did manage to kill him with the 250 and uh, that's the that, that's, border, that's the ballista defensive capability yeah. right there but uh okay so hello everyone again right here we're gonna showcase the reverse speed of the chieftain um with the enemy uh, colonial infantry I'm guy rushing at us with the usual colonial equipment okay so uh, we can start plex you can start running at us and as you can see, the chieftain outspeeds the infantry running. Tell me, we just it, went to fire. Not being able to throw the stickies. Uh, I think if he can't outrun us, we can just shoot him. So he's not even able to get close enough to throw the sticky. He can basically and, run at the uh, same pace as us. And uh, he's just dead. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much my experience. Yeah, that's about the same position. So, um, right here we're gonna showcase another colonial <laughs> infantry run at the Chieftain uh, and test the Chieftain's reverse speed. This time uh, the infantry guy is gonna use Ignifists, not the Stickies. And we can start. So I'm gonna start reversing back and as you can see the infantry guy is gonna start ru rushing at us. Let's give him some time until the crossroads if he can catch up. And uh, right here, we're gonna see if the infantry can catch up until the crossroads and use his Ignifist on us. Okay, that was a bounce. And, and I think dead. that's it, because so by this point, a chieftain would have fight back. So we just hold the, the A key, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we basically just go uh, up and left and showcase the turning speed. Just, you know, keep yeah, doing yeah. the forward and A and then because uh, yeah, right, yeah sure you do it first and I do it maybe yeah yeah yeah. so here we're showcasing the turning speed of the ballista versus the chieftain and uh, as you will s slowly see 360 while the chieftain will kind of go a little yeah, bit it's wider definitely worse. and uh, yeah, as you can see we're both holding W and A but uh, I ended chieftain up in is a different uh, position still more close is it the same? But it, it's just um, a little bit faster, which allows it to have faster turns, basically. But it goes definitely wider. Its turning speed is a little worse than the ballistas. Shift in speed in comparison. Okay, okay. Okay, so uh, we're gonna line up and uh, sh let's just say when the speed. When. Yep, yep. Okay, so I'm gonna start going and then uh, you start uh, pushing W. 
Okay, get ready. Okay. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's go. So yeah, as you can see the uh the um speed Damn this thing is so bad is uh eating dirt. It's kinda similar. Um it's still faster than the C V and the chieftain I don't even see him. He's long gone. 